Hey guys, it's Shmoy Baby Sham 30, Shmoy aka Baby Sham 33 here. So, <clears throat> going to do um, a quick video on uh, Corvus Clave, um, his mechanics, and just uh, some of the best fighting styles to go with him. Um, so, I have a quick look at his synerg synergies. Um, hunt the uncanny. Um, if you knock out a mutant champion once the mission is complete, Carvis Clay receives safeguard against um, opponent special to attack if uh, Clave Immunities is active. Um, with Proxima Midnight, if you use um, a heavy attack or a special to knock down a hero that has used evade or auto block in a fight, um, his true damage becomes true strike. So, great against Medusas, or Spider-Mans, and so forth. And uh, the Infinity Enemies, all champions gain 7% um, attack. Um, as for his abilities, um, the basics with uh, Corvus, um, he starts out with the Glaive Charges, and he starts out with 20, he has 20 of them. Guarantees a crit on every attack for the first 20. Once that's done, he goes into a cooldown mode um, before they uh, they refresh. His awakened ability, um, basically, as long as he has clave charges active, he can't die. So if you're taking damage from, say, bleed or poison, as long as you have clave charges, you know, you're not going to to die from that damage. Of course, if you take, you know, um, a hit, the clave charges go down, uh, you will die. Um, but that's his safeguard. So, um, he has four missions. Mission one is eliminate an Avenger. If you um, knock, some, knock out um, someone with the Avenger title, um, he gains an extra 10 clave charges, so that goes up to 30. Um, if you take down a tech champion, um, then um, tech champions have 25% 20, reduced ability accuracy. Um, if you knock out a mutant, um, he grants safeguard. If he has a synergy with uh, Wolverine, next 23 or Storm is uh, mission four. Um, as I said, if you use the heavy or special attack to knock down an evading hero, um, or someone that uses auto block in a fight, um, you know, his true damage beco um, buff becomes a true strike. But that's with the Proxima Synergy. Um, that's the, the basics of it. I won't go over all of the, you know, you know, his crit damage and so forth. Um, you know, as I said, um, once the, you know, you run out of clave charges, Basically, you know, for 50 seconds, it's on cooldown, so it's a long cooldown time. Um, that cooldown time is actually reduced if he's awakened, though. Um, special 2 is unblockable. Um, and on his special 3, if the opponent is about to gain, um, you know, an S3 it actually reduces the power, so, um, you know, kind of keeps them underneath that S3 level. Um, when his clave charges are up, as you know, he is immune to bleed um, cold and cold snap. Um, he is not immune to poison, so um, because of that, he is pretty suicide friendly. Um, you know, a lot of people run him that way to ramp up the damage. Um, that aside, we're going to get into some quick fights um, to show the best method uh, of using him. Because of his clave charges, um, you know, as I said, you're starting off with basically 20 clave charges. Um, what you want to do, or the best thing to do, is to... Um, Instead of doing the standard five hit combo where you do medium, light, um, medium, triple light, um, 
medium you want to keep it to really three or four hit combos um, medium light light medium or medium light medium uh, um, this is going to basically give you um, the most damage possible um, so first one we have here is going to be a tech um, the other nice thing about Corvus is every time that he uses um, a heavy attack, um, a parry, you gain a nice armor break. And if you notice, like I said, I'm medium, 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 light, medium. Actually, that was a. Uh, medium light light medium so as you notice those crits on the um, on the mediums you know without you know missions being completed first um, you know you're getting at least 2800 um, above and above while there's you know um, one, I think it was about 16 17 K on the light attacks so like I said, you want to take advantage of much as many mediums as possible. Um, is the ideal play style when uh, using Corvus. I'll just go here to Ultron. Said so the nice thing about uh, Corvus, also the proximal synergy, as I was mentioning, is when it comes to the um, the true strike uh, so we're just going to kind of go in here okay use the heavy and hopefully this doesn't kill him oh. okay well <laughs> Unfortunately, he died sooner than I wanted to. But if he had used it, he uses his heavy, and if I'm then able to knock him down using, um, using either the heavy attack or a special, you know, as long as he doesn't die, um, then I would have gained that uh, that true strike buff. Um, we're gonna exit out of this. But the other thing about Corvus um, that makes him um, so nice to use is the fact that he is uh, great when it comes to taking on, um, this is a biohazard path. So as you know, when struck, 20% um, chance to inflict bleed. The other hundred percent of um, attack is direct damage. Um, I said so. As long as he has those clave charges up, um, he technically is bleed immune. So you'll get a bleed on you, but if you're running willpower, the only thing he'll do is actually end up healing you. Um, but like I said once again, he is not poison immune, so uh, you want to avoid po poison paths. But bleed, uh, you're okay as long as you have the clave charges up. Once the glaive charges run out, um, you will end up taking, um, you know, taking all of that damage. So you always want to get the fight done. Basically, see, poison, you're going to take that damage. And you notice the blade, the only thing I'm doing is healing. As I said, the best combo method is going to be um, those three hit. 
the medium medium I'm sorry uh, light medium I'm sorry uh, <laughs> medium light medium attacks is going to be uh, it's been a long day um, medium light medium um, is always the best rotation um, if you're more comfortable you know light uh, medium light light medium uh, you can go for the four hits but because you want to use um, you want to take full advantage of um, your clave charges you know you really want to um, like I said keep the combo count down and get the max amount of damage <coughs> And just to finish off quickly, um, so come out of here. Sorry, it's supposed to be a um, frost cube. It's supposed to be an Emmer Frost. Frosty cube. There we go. Um, the fantastic thing about uh, using Corvus is that um, because on his parries, you always get that armor break. He is fantastic for fighting against Emma Frost and getting her out of that diamond form. And there you go. Easy peasy, I remember Frost down. Where um, you know, I, I mean, I wish I had Corvus when um, Emma Frost first came out, and you know, everybody was struggling trying to um, fight her. If you didn't have someone um, that broke that armor um, off the bat, but he is fantastic uh, for fighting her. Um, similar. If you have to fight um, Sentinel, um, you have that armor break. You can really um, increase the damage output. Um, also with Sentinel, because you are trying to keep him from um, from building up those analyst charges. You know, so Sentinels you always want to fight medium light medium. So no analyst charges medium light medium medium light medium which has um two mediums but um you see my my point but perfect and with those two fights you'd have also gained um you'd have also completed a mission um both against emma because she's a mutant and sentinel as he is um a tech champion I said, if you knock out an Avenger, you go from 20 clave charges to 30. Um, so those are some of the basics when it comes to um, using a using Corvus Clave. Um, he's a fantastic hero. Um, you know, not really meant for um, long fights. As I said, once he runs out of those clave charges, um, he does hit somewhat like a wet noodle. Um, and it's, you know, no longer a fun time, but for, um, quick fights, like I said, if you want to run suicide, um, things of that, um, nature, he is just amazing at, uh, getting through quest and, um, dominating in things like Alliance War or even Alliance Quest. Um, 
So hope you got hope you found this um helpful. Have a fantastic night. Be blessed.